In September, we will be approving the use of neighborhood golf carts, allowing slow moving vehicles to use our roadways. These golf carts are able to go up to 30 kilometers an hour. They need to have seat belts in them. They need to be a little bit modified, which costs something between about five and $700. But they are an environmentally friendly form of transportation. And for many senior citizens, they are a much more preferable uh, form of transportation and easier um, to me makes it easier for them to maintain their independence. Today's announcement is something that will greatly benefit so many people in our community here in Qualcomm Beach and something I'm personally excited about, something that is very innovative. Uh, sometimes um, we need to think a little bit outside of the box to grow with our aging community and our communities around the province. You know when we started doing some more trail work in Qualcomm Beach and trails are important for many, for many aspects, for walking, biking, scooters, skateboards. The Dolly Mount Trail, down from the Legion to basically a Chartwell area, I wanted that wide enough so that if you met another golf cart on the way, you could pass each other. Mm -hmm. So we were planning ahead. We we're very pleased that you've chosen us as a pilot project, which is entirely appropriate. Mm -hmm. And we'd love to work with you to help people not only be more mobile and engaging, but also protect the environment from in, by reducing greenhouse gas. Mm -hmm. <laughs> So over the next two years with the community of Qualicum and Minister Michelle Stilwell um, and also the community of Chase, which is the other community that's participating, we'll be collecting all the information and the feedback to make sure that we can do this safely and make sure that it's meeting the needs of seniors and communities. Without working together, we wouldn't be able to make these things possible.